right, y'all, welcome to Fort Mojave. I believe we're in Arizona. It's right on the river next to Nevada, uh, Bullhead City. And of course, we're here for the legendary Laughlin River Run. Got a rad group of people here that I've connected with, all the locals. We're gonna run up into Oatman, and uh, we're gonna show you some good flavor of the Wild West. So without further ado, let's get this started. So you're digging that dino, huh, bro? It's a faux show. I like it. It's not gonna shit. Let's take a look at it. I really like it. I like the seat. This is my way. Yeah, that's nice. Jeez. That's a good looking bike. Whose bike is that? Hammers. That's your bike? Yep. It's a nice bike, bro. Thank you. How many miles you put on that? Uh, I ride it. It's gone to Mexico. I ride to Mexico. I ride to Mexico. I ride to Texas. Hell yeah. <laughs> this thing's gorgeous too. Whose is this? Our boy Dakota's. Hundred percent paid for by insurance. Nice. <laughs> Nothing wrong with that. That's some good content right there. <laughs> Beautiful. You know what they call these right here? No. It's called a lane splitter, essentially. There's those oh. handlebars up high like that. Because out west, you can ride in between traffic. Split it. You can split the lanes. You know, there's rules to it, speeds and stuff like that. But actually, I think it's safer. I think it is too. I don't want to stop. Right. Rear ends come from behind all the time. So. And the traffic's so bad out west, I think a lot of times they just want people to get moving. Yeah. If you got space to go, move, go, move. Go. You know, so. I like it. Out west in California, you can split lanes, and that's why. That handlebar style like that has become so popular. And I like it anyway. Yeah, it looks good, right? All right, here we go. We're gonna go ahead and load up and uh, we're gonna take y'all for a ride uh, through the desert, up into Oatman. I'm old Route 66. And uh, you guys saw Oatman in our last video, but today we're gonna show you inside Oatman just a little bit. This is Oatman, a little bitty old school mining town. But what's so cool about it is the burrows run wild on the streets. And come Laughlin River Run, as you can see, this place is packed with motorcycles. You say hi to him. Is that jackass? That's a jackass. It's an ass. I love it. <laughs>
got me. Right there, we got the famous Oatman Hotel, established in 1902. And that's where Clark Gable and Carol Lombard had their honeymoon night on their way down Route 66. And it's haunted. There, it's haunted. It is haunted. Supposedly. It's a cool bar in there, too. All right, so this, I guess, they say is the bar. Pretty wild, man. I love it. Oh, yeah, this is more like dollar bills. It's like amazing. Holy shit. Well, there you go, y'all. This seems to be the spot. How much money do y'all think is on these walls right now? That's some serious coin. You got any guesses? Uh, $42. $42. And a foot. And a foot. I bet you. Adam! Yeah. How hey, are you man. doing? Good, He's been looking for you for two years. <laughs> high five, high five. High five, brother. There you go. What's going on? Oh, it, man. Hey, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. What do you think? I think it's great. I think you're... He wants a book. I happen to have one sitting on my bike. I'm gonna go get the man a book. All right, so I got my book, and I'm gonna honor him with it just for being so excited uh, to connect with me. Uh, I always appreciate people that give me that kind of support. And then I'm gonna find out if he is a veteran. If not, I'm gonna ask him to help me find a veteran in that bar, and uh, we're gonna give him a brand new pair of boots. Just a little way to say thank you. Thank you very much. You're awesome. Yeah. Well, we just grab a pen. I'll sign it. Yeah, he's got a pen. Go grab a marker. Are you a veteran? Yes, ma'am. You are what sir? Grab a marker. Air Force man. Well, thank you very much for my freedom, sir. Thank you. I'd also like thank to honor you with a you. brand new pair of boots, man. From Harley Davidson. So just you go online, you can go any pair of boots you want. Harley Davidson wants to say thank you for everything you've done for our country and have some fresh boots on your feet as well. Back and roll, man. Mike, thank you for my freedom. I'm using it every day, buddy. How's that for emotional? It was a good time. It made me cry. You did. He I was holding he back did cry tears. a little bit. I cried a little bit. You did bit. cry a little. Two tears. I know it happens. Oh, but that was sweet, right? Yeah, he, man. He accepted that with an open yeah, he heart and just broke him down and made him feel good. Those are the best people to honor. Sharing the road with good people. Amen. Everyone and we always good. say honor, man. It's not. It's not giving. It's not surprising. It's not yeah. gifting. It's honoring. Honoring. Anytime you're a military member. And we give you something. It's an honor. I'm glad you got to experience that, man. It's good stuff. Let's do it Absolutely. Again. I don't think we can do much about much more else here in Oatman. I think we should uh, hit the road and maybe get up at one of those lookouts. What do you say? Let's go check it out. All right. Guess where we happen to be? The exact place. We spent the night the other night on top of this mountain. What do you think of that ride in, Gage? It's great. It's it beautiful, very right? beautiful. Yeah. yeah. Is that one of your top most beautiful roads? Top, probably. 
Probably the number one. I love it. Does this look familiar to you? Yes. <laughs> this is where the donkeys kept waking us up. Yeah. Sweet little place. Yeah. Mike's just coming through left and right. So there's a cemetery <laughs> up there. There is. We, we a stumbled cemetery. on it. Yes. We stumbled on it. Was this crosses? Yeah, we're like, what wait the? a minute. Yeah. Like we're camping here. There's crosses. <laughs> no, we're all up on the edge of that, up on the edge of that ridge there. It's kind of a pet cemetery. A lot of people in the, in the oh, area or in the country. What did you just say? Pet cemetery. It's a pet cemetery? People bring their, oh, their the ashes of their pets up here. <laughs> And they, they let them go over the view and they build a little We've seen that movie. Brother, we, 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 were, we were in the pet cemetery. We made it through it. Though. Talking about ghosts and aliens. Bigfoot. Bigfoot. Gotta talk about Bigfoot. We did. We talked about Bigfoot. Uh, we well, talked about all the things that a couple men should talk about over a couple bottles yeah. of Coors on top of a mountain That's by the did. moonlight. <laughs> That's what we did. Good times. Well, let's go take a look at it in the daylight now that it's... Maybe we'll all get a picture up there. Okay. Yeah. That'd be cool. I don't think that was like that. Is that decorated the other night like that? Yeah, the beads? Yeah. I didn't even... You mean I didn't notice that? I can't believe you didn't notice that. Jesus. Yeah, I was looking at that. I was like, man, look at these beads. I can't even notice that. Even what? Yeah, well, you know, we didn't see down there. It's a pet Where you slept the other night? Yeah, that's where we slept. Yeah, so when we sat down, <laughs> then we looked at one like, what? Yeah, then we looked up and we saw all them <laughs> crosses and crosses. Then we were like, started oh, reading man. and we were like, what? <laughs> what is going on here with all these crosses? Yeah, we started reading this, crash and burn. And all the stars <laughs> explode tonight. <laughs> what the? We were like, that ain't good. And there's all these beads. And these are all solar lights, see? So they were all lit up. Oh, okay. So I thought there was people up here. It turned out, nope, just us in the pet cemetery. A little creepy, but absolutely beautiful. beautiful. We slept great, man. We just pulled some tarps off our bikes back there and just. Crashed up on this hill, man, with the stars, and well, every two hours a dog just came and visited us. Yeah, wild well, asses. Huh? Yep. Cars oh, those are, those are cars yeah. down there. That's right. That rad. didn't make that curve. Oh, <laughs> oh. shit. You see that? Right. Oh. And you can kind of make out. It's I don't know if y'all can see them. You can kind of make out on the, right there, the original uh, Buell Maybe Trail. Okay. General Buell, back in the 1850s, oh, used to use camels. And this is his original trail from Kingman down to Oat Mitten, out to Fort Mojave. So what? they went from Fort Buell to Fort That's Mojave. That's the original trail right That's there? That's the original trail. They used see, cut wa in? wagons and horses, and they'd work their way all the way out to Fort Mojave. Could you imagine being on horseback and buggy <laughs> and crossing <laughs> these <laughs> mountains? You know what I mean? Buggy. I mean, like, you're looking over this, and there's no minimum <laughs> drinking. Like, what are you feeding your horses for water? I don't know, man. Oof. Tough, tough, tough. Tough times. And men were hardy. We think we're tough. Sure. Yeah. Hell, them women were tougher than we are. Yeah. Those men. Yeah. I agree. I mean, a lot of them still are, but. Yeah, they are still. We got a couple that are. Unreal. So pretty. It's gorgeous out here. All right, this is where I'm going to do my sign out. Thank you for joining along on these vlogs. I appreciate all of you and all my friends. Everybody get we in here. We are the Americans! Get in here behind me, everybody. Can everybody see their face? No. Find your face, find your face. All right, y'all, until the next vlog, from all of us on top of this mountain, where where, where exactly, what, what is this mountain? Uh, Strict Greaves Pass. Strict Greaves Pass. I smell good, don't I? <laughs> your pants don't. Ashley, I'll be home soon. All right, we'll talk to y'all soon. Bye, y'all. Y'all, have a great day, and uh, from the Americans, remember, dream until your dreams come true. <laughs>